your host, your favorite life and business coach, and I hope you guys are having a good day. Welcome to Reflection Deep in, in Chef Ebony Rocks, Economy Travel Vlog. Today we have a special, special review. This review is from Slutty Vegan. <laughs> Slutty Vegan has come a long way in their journey. You know, I remember when they were just, you know, up the way in Atlanta in a food truck and, you know, they have a storefront. They're opening many more other stores. They even have an opening on this upcoming Saturday. So, I am finally, for the first time, actually tasting some Slutty Vegan. So, we've had some situations <laughs> that happened between the long lines, you know what I mean? So, initially, there was probably four different types of occasions where we were going to go. The line was too long, we were too hungry already, and I want to say about uh, two weeks ago, they actually had a few uh, people like Gabrielle Union, uh, Lala Anthony, um, Ludacris, and I can't remember his name, basketball player, and it's going to come to me. I actually had this, day, I want to say it was a Tuesday or Wednesday, where they just had free food for the entire day. So we got there, you know, in my mind, I felt like we should have gotten there for 11.30 to be there for 12.30. In my mind, for some reason, I thought they opened at 12.30. Well, they opened up at noon. And so we got there later than we attended. And um, the line was crazy. The line probably went about three miles back. We got there, it was about two blocks behind. Um, but by the time we drove around a couple times, we knew we weren't going to do it. So we kind of just said we were going to come back later. But before we could come back later, once we started to talk over when we were going to go, Piggy actually told us that they were sold out for the day. And of course, you know what? It is what it is because it's Slutty Vegan. There were some people that were online for four hours and they said it was worth every penny. We didn't get that opportunity. I told them early in the morning, let's go to Slutty Vegan because I was on watching them on Instagram live yesterday and I said I think this is the perfect something is telling me in my spirit the night last night we should go today it sh you know we should go so when we got there the line was actually and it's so weird how you have to calculate this right you have the slutty vegan building right that entire area there uh, because it's six feet it looks a lot longer but it's always long lines but it's a, a lot more longer because now people have to be six feet apart so you know they tell you ahead of time bring your water your shades stay hydrated for me i say bring your backup batteries um, some headphones something that could distract you maybe bring a, a few of your friends the more the merrier Nala decided to get a phone she watched TikToks, and Ebony and I were talking but the line went by so much faster than I thought I think we were in line for about 45 minutes maybe to an hour I can't not determine that and then as we got closer we started to hear you know a lot of noise uh, music we heard yelling and it sounded like people were just having fun so it wasn't anything negative everyone was just having having so much fun and you know this is kind of the experience that I told you know Anala because she's nine and you know kid doesn't want to sit in line for food in their mind why can we just go to the drive-thru why, why can't we just go here I said look we have to support black businesses you know it's a lot for you to understand at this age right now but you want to support people who are looking out for our health wealth uh, and you know this is gonna help us stay here for as long as we can this is gonna help us uh, build each other up as a company as a brand as a business as a label whatever you want to call it all right and you just want to support the best way you can you know a lot of times when you support another business it's not about always making a purchase it's about getting on their their social medias and leaving a like or a comment or leaving a follow or, or subscribe on their social media because that helps them in so many ways so, so many small ways you can help one person and it doesn't have to always cost you know so back to this review when you see that long line like I said just prepare for the long line some people say in the comments uh, to come a little later when it's close to closing time but once again I tried to do that and they were sold out all right so use your best judgment like i said for us we got there at about 12. we got there at about 12. they opened at 12. we got there at about 12 20. and the line was on the same block right it was on the same block and um time went by pretty fast i want to say 
Ebony said an hour, I say 45 minutes because it really wasn't that long. It didn't hurt my feet and nothing like that. When the line went, the line went. They have a really good process. If you follow them on Instagram, they tell you what they have on the menu. Then when you get up far enough, you get to really see what's going on. So, it's a bug. So what they're trying to do is eliminate so many people being inside of that building. So what they do is they take your order they, and you wait and get their order, you go and then you come in, right? So it's a pretty good process to have someone taking your order. If you have water or juice that you're gonna buy, they, they hook you up with that. And you just wait on your food and you get that experience. There's music going, you know, once again, I not I loved it, right? So after trying to get her to be okay with all these times we've tried to go, and she was not happy this time. She loved it. She loved the food. She loved the experience. And we most definitely will be back, okay? I'm just telling you that before the taste test. Because of when people make you feel special, you want to come back. You know what I mean? So it is what it is. Um, so let's get into this. So once again, I've never eaten here before. Ebony is really a stickler about eating in the car. But she was so hungry but didn't have any breakfast because we checked out and a couple of things started happening. We got a little crazy. We got there and she was not willing to go home and wash her hands, okay? Was not willing to do that. We did our old school hand wash in the car, out the window, sanitizer, all that. So they give you a burger and a fry, right? Your meal automatically automatically comes with a fry. You're not doing this all the car, you're not doing, no. When you get, you get what you get and then be good. Right, because it's going to be good. And for people who don't like french fries or don't care for that much french fries, I still recommend you get the french fries because there's sauce, you have the, they have the um, slut dust, what they call it, seasoning, they have slutty sauce, which is the zone sauce. So I say get the, get the fries and enjoy the fries. Don't give them away or don't not eat them. Eat them while they're fresh, right? Those are the kind of fries you got to eat them while they're fresh. I'm going to do my taste test. I already had the fries and they were amazing, but... I'm gonna actually try the actual burger. All right, let's get into it. So here's the bag that they give you. Nice bag, it has some writing on it. It says a whole bunch of stuff on it, but it also says slutty vegan ATL. It says eat powered by grass, plant, um, you know, all that stuff. Plant, plant-based, vegan, proud to be, too cute to eat, all this stuff, right? Anyway, it's very, very cool. Designed by Finesse A. Williams underscore. Nice. Okay. So, here's the bag. Same thing for the paper bag. The same thing for the other bag. I actually have to warm up my food. My food is not ready to be eaten. So, but I just wanted to un do the unbagging for you. Here's what it looks like before you open it. You have your beautiful... The name of your burger here, ours is called Sloppy Toppy. Did not know it came with jalapeno, so I'll be picking mine out, but I'll let you see it before I pick them out. What's up, kiddo? You chilling? This smells spicy. And there's slutty sauce everywhere. I think it's cheese, slut sauce, and vegan cheese. The slutty, the Sloppy Toppy comes with the impossible burger, lettuce, tomatoes, I want to say jalapenos, yes, jalapenos, grilled onions, and slutty sus. Looks good though. Anyway, I know this might not be the best review because mine is like soggy and stuff. It's not really soggy, it actually looks good to be something that's been sitting here for so long, so. Um, I'm not going to show you all of it. I'm just going to eat and tell you what it tastes like, all right? So, see you in the next scene. You guys are going to see a video from my family from their car review. So, check it out. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. I'm excited. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. We're getting closer. <laughs> y'all oh we made it. it three times the charm all right come on it took us three weeks to get a meal taste the ginger in that we have a little bit more sense. i like it because they compliment you and you're hot and they have you up before you get your food that make you excited about eating it does like they 
they they they announce where you're from initially, and then when you start dancing to the music, they announce you out to the whole entire place. And what's the place? What you talking about? You? What you place? What you talking about? <gasps> That's a lot of sauce. Oh, that looks good. I'm about to. Oh, I'm about to. Oh, I'm about to get into this right here. Oh! I can't wait. Yeah, okay. It looks like that sauce. It I got my like sweat that. dust on here. Oh, sweat that. Sweat that. Ow, 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 Jesus. Ow. 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 We could have already been home by now if we didn't get no soy vegan, but I'm proud that we got my bloody vegan. Let's be the one who tastes it first because mine's already open. You better bite into it because I'm about to, about to rip it a new one right this moment. Mm. What'd you say, fool? Hey, hey. Hey, 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 what'd you say, boo? It's delicious. That's what I'm talking about. For a non meat burger? For a non meat burger, huh? Yeah. Okay. Can you taste a vegan? Can you taste the vegan and the cheese? Uh huh. You can? Yeah. You can tell it's vegan cheese? Oh, mm hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, don't. I'm you, I don't even like all this kind of sauce. If I'm about to rip this thing a new one, I got me a couple of jalapenos in here. I got some too. Where about me that? Like that. Like what? that. Ooh, that's good. For the first time, Maj, what's your review? We Hazard reported it. Right, that is delicious. I, I'm about to I feel like I can eat this in two minutes. I don't know what I'm tasting, but I like it. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. They're wrong for this. Mm. So, what do you say? I'm vegan diet. So, what do you say about those people that say it's not good? They're lying. And they got bad, they got a bad customer service. They're all lying. Those people that was putting them. That's just, 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 Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What you gonna feed them? No, let the camera. Oh, I'm just gonna a small bite. Oh, yeah, give me back in burger, okay? <laughs> I I'll pay you back in burger. No, pay me back in burger, okay? I think you took a big bite. Oh! <laughs> babe, babe. Uh, uh, that's good. Oh my god. Oh, that's real bad. Oh my god. Oh, baby yeah. burger. Dude. What is this? I don't even know what I'm tasting, but. When we came down here, people oh. said they were standing in line for six hours for a free burger and it was still worth it. I see what they mean. How you liking this, babe? Yeah, hey. don't get doing it, water. I want to go back and get another one. <laughs> this was a wonderful idea. Sure. It's probably the best idea. Look at the cows, all poor things. Moo. They're like, Moo. I'm not eating you. I'm not eating We're not you. eating y'all. I'm not eating you. The vegan. The sort of vegan, y'all. Don't come spin it through our window. You had to give it a, a, a one to ten. What would Thousand. you give it? A thousand? Let me tell you, my baby, she like to eat, but she's not one of those kids that eat anything. I'm not gonna say she picky either, but her mom's a chef, celebrity chef. She's very picky about her taste buds, okay? <laughs> so if y'all take it from nine year old and say from one to ten is a thousand, I think y'all need to just take that. Really? Take that, take that. Really? Take I got about two more bites and I'm so sad right now, I ain't gonna lie. You can have some of mine. Oh, it's okay. So anyway, y'all, like and subscribe. Now I loved it. Omni is moaning and groaning and yelling about it. So she loves it. When you have this, you are going to love it. And if you ever hear, ever, ever, ever hear someone say, oh, this ain't good. They're There's lying. too much of this. There's too much of that. They lying and they trolling. Because uh -huh. okay. there's been a lot of trolls on her there page. There's a lot of sauce. And the sauce begins at that yourself. You ever see a line and you're like, ooh, I don't want to get the line. It's too long. It worked it. It worked it. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe to Slutty Vegan. They tell you every day what's on the menu. They also tell you to bring your water. Facebook. Sunglasses. Instagram or on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Sunglasses. Sunglasses. Mandatory. Your mask. Your mask. mask is mandatory. They have the lines for six feet. So keep your distance. Okay? Charge up your battery well, if you need. looks like six feet, it's really six feet. It's six feet. Everybody, you know, but keep your phone charged. Find you something to do. Watch the rest of your, your binge watch on Netflix. Watch, watch some TikToks. You know, mama, talk to your mama. And I'm not to go by so fast. Woo! Yep. Dang, that was good.
Let's go get back in line. I knew she was gonna say that. I knew it. <laughs> I knew you was gonna say it when you did that. Woo! I said, Lord, she's gonna get back in line. She's gonna go tell us to make a U turn. And Woo! then watch it in the morning. Really What's gonna happen in the morning, baby? Can we baby, go? Can we go? Can we go back? I ain't gonna lie, baby. See? Baby, we get a slutty thing in the morning. To make it a family thing, we'll make it a family thing where we all just we all need to all just stack up and stuff. Look at this. I'm calling my family to let them know how good I talk to them about how good this is. They loved it. All right, they loved it up for a couple seconds, so it's not too hot. All right, a little smoke coming from it. All right, so this is a sloppy toppy. Like I said before, it has the it has jalapenos, it has um, lettuce, tomatoes, grilled onions, and the slutty sauce. And like I said, it comes with the fries, which were amazing. I ate those in the car because I am the kind of person, I like my fries fresh. I will leave everything to the side. I just want my fries right then and there. I'm gonna try this thing, all right? So once again, boom, bang. I know the camera isn't cl that close, but check it out. We bought this a few hours ago, so. Um, I had to get my house in order, all right, before I ate a little bit. All right, so I'm not a tomato person, so I'm gonna take my tomatoes out. Don't be a hater. Don't be a hater. And I'm not a jalapeno person. Once again, I didn't know this one had jalapenos in it, so I'm just gonna take those out. Um, I don't really care for onions, but I'm just gonna, I'm gonna let that one go. I'm gonna let that one go, you know what I mean? I'm not gonna take all of it out. And as you see here, got some vegan cheese here. Once again, this is slutty vegan. Everything is vegan. Um, I'll tell you what, we were trying to figure out, you know, how can we get slutty vegan in a budget? You know what I mean? Cause they hit, and it's not pricey. I think the burgers are about um, 13 to $15 or something like that. And they have a couple of other things like uh, some, I think a vegan type of chicken and a vegan shrimp as well. Um, I wanted to get that, but they sold out before I got there. So, here's the burger. I'm actually going to cut it. Um, just so you know what, I don't be looking like a fat girl in front of y'all. Because I don't know y'all like that yet. Y'all judge me. It's on. Now, let me get some of this sauce, though. This sauce, they're speaking on this sauce. Sauce is pretty good. Alright. Now, I don't eat beef or pork. So when I look at this, it gives me the whole beef vibe. Kind of confuses me a little bit, um, but it smells vegan. Does it smell like a bunch of beef or pork, which is cool. Oh, it's just even vegan. It gives me like, I ain't trying to be funny, but when you guys go to Burger King, you get that sauce, get that burger, and that sauce from Burger King. It doesn't taste like Burger King, but it, it kind of gives me that whole charboil type of vibe. Burger King can't even touch this. I don't even know why I said that, but I hope you guys got my drift, so. This hidden. This is hitting no mayonnaise no mustard just the slutty sauce which just like a few things i ain't gonna give it away you know i fucks with this so i'm i'm a, i'm a y'all just gotta come through y'all gotta come through if you guys are visiting atlanta um check them out follow them on social media and um uh, make make plans to come through make plans to come through This is really good. The jalapenos are pretty hot. So, when I eat spicy food, I get the hiccup. 
I get the hiccups. So, I don't even know what that's, what that's about. I've been like this since I was a kid. I eat spicy food. I get the, I get the hiccups. So, this turned weird fast. It's my water, my Dunkin' Donuts cup. All right. So yeah, I don't do spicy food. Nala tries to do spicy food because she wants to like, you know, eat what her mom's eating. But even though she, she knows she can't eat spicy food. So this piece is a special piece. I'm gonna leave this piece for Ebony. You know why? Let me tell you, story time. Ebony um, was just screaming and yelling and dancing in the car from how good it was, as you see. This is good. This is really good. And she said, I'm still taking the jalapenos off. She's like, I said, well, I thought she was trying to offer me a piece, okay? When I, well, normally when I buy food, I do the driving. I do all the driving. And when we eat and we, when she allows us to eat in the car, she'll feed me. I thought she was giving me some to taste it or give her a piece of her burger. And she's like, oh, I was just trying to show the camera. You're trying to show the camera, but you ain't trying to share? That's cool. I see what, I see what kind of relationship this is. That's cool. So I was like, um, let me get a piece. I'll give you a piece of mine later. You know what I mean? I feel like I'm in freaking fourth grade. I'm going to give you, give me a Skittle. I'm going to give you a Skittle later. Like, we ain't no kids. You know what I mean? I just spent $50 on this food. You could have gave me some for free. Plus, this is bomb right here. Ebony, she eats a spicy burger once a week. I have to put her on a budget, some sort. She's a tourist. Most tourist women, they are, or men, they like to eat. They enjoy the food. They are like foodies. They don't just like to eat, eat. They like to enjoy really good food. And um, so if you date somebody that's a tourist and you realize they eat, a little bit more often or they like this really good quality of food that's because that's just who they are ebony loves eating spicy burgers from this other establishment that we go to um that's really close by a couple lights away and we basically go every wednesday um we didn't go because we were at the chateau Elan, and so she had a really good expensive burger there um but yeah she actually wanted to go back she was like babe can we turn back around um, she's probably gonna ask me tomorrow can we go and um, based on the taste of this um, I might say yes I might say yeah I might I just might this is, this is good. I most definitely I most definitely would um go back a little, probably a little bit more often than I should. Another thing I want to tell you, when you go there for the first time, they're going to ask you, have you been here before? You say yes or no, and then they're going to say, what's your name and where are you from? You tell them, and they'll say, they'll just shout you out, and um, it's very cool. It's a beautiful experience. Um, Shout out to Pinky for just creating this amazing experience for black people and um, working to get us healthy, right? Um, that's really important uh, based on, especially in the time that we are in right now with just um, working on our immune system and making sure we're healthy. And um, a lot of those products that we do, you know, use are, aren't as healthy as we know dairy, animal products, um, things with high sugar, high salt, just things that we shouldn't be doing as black people and our bodies are immune to certain things um, and we just make it worse. So, I, you know, shout out to Pinky for really creating that experience and once again, follow them, Slutty Vegan ATL. Go with your friends, go with a bunch of people you enjoy hanging out with and if the lines are long, just stay there and wait. All right, the fact that you got a good parking spot, get your parking spot, 
and stand in line. I promise you, you won't regret it. Make sure you subscribe to all of our social media accounts, um, starting with YouTube. The first one is Reflection Deep and Chef Ebony Rocks. Family Travel Vlog, that's one page. There's another page. Ebony has a page that she's gonna be working on. We got, a, we got a lot to sort out. We got a lot of stuff building out I got going on. But subscribe to Ebony, all right? Cause you're gonna see her pretty soon as Chef Ebony Rocks. You also have Reflection Deep TV where me and myself, I'm going to hook you up with a bunch of free meditations. And you know, with that as well, we have our online store called the Meditation Collection. The Meditation Collection is something that I worked on really hard to make sure we have health, wealth, peace, love, and happiness in this world, all right? We got one life to live and we must live it healthy. We must live it within full wealth, health. We must live it in happiness and peace and love. Okay. With all those things, uh, with all those things mixed up in between, you got to check out the meditation collection because we have books, we have meditation jewelry. Um, there's a lot to learn there. We have sage, we have stones, we have meditation for the kids. Once again, subscribe to Reflection Deep TV for free meditations. Okay. We also have the last one, which is my pride and joy, my passion, uh, Kennedy's life coaching business solution. That is my actual page um, to where you're going to learn about business tips. You're going to learn about how to start your business. You're going to learn about aligning your mind, heart, spirit to even find your passion. Once again, no matter what, where you are in life, this page is going to benefit you uh, to the utmost. All these pages are going to going to benefit you. We also have our social medias for our Instagram. We have Chef, e Chef Ebony Rocks. We have Reflection Deep, right? That's Kimmy's Life Coaching Business Solutions, but it's me. We also have the meditation collection, the meditation underscore collection on Instagram. We also have those same ones on Facebook. So go check us out everywhere. I got it. I got the hook up in the description. Let's go do it. Closing out this video Everybody and then guess who comes down. Oh, I hear my name. I left Why this you for you. It up in here? I left this for you. You left this for me? Oh, no. Man, you left this. No. You're so, oh. Baby, no. why you do that? I didn't even do yours like that. That was good. No, no, no. I actually legit, I ate more bread than you. I saw your big old mouth. You encompass my whole burger. You'll be all right. Give me that jalapeno. It's on video. Okay. And what? Who's going to check me, boo? Me? You know how. I'm going to get back in line right now. I'll be back. You know how you see somebody who wants your food so they're eating fast. <laughs> Man, that's delicious. I don't know what they put in that mess. I still don't know what I'm eating, but Jesus is worthy. Baby, can I get my mama back? No. I need jalapeno with it. <laughs> I'm gonna do the whole thing. Mm. Oh! Lord have mercy. Mm -mm -mm. Since you're here, guess what happened to me? What happened? A lot happened today. But. What happened that I don't know? I had a jalapeno on camera. <laughs> you know what happened? On purpose? No. Oh. You know what happened? Right. What happened? What happened when I get the hiccups? You I mean, got the hiccups? I, I got the hiccups. The jalapeno makes the burger Ooh. though. The bite is like. Got my duck and water. Mm. Mm. I should have pinched a straw on you. Why do you do this to me? Um, first of all, if you're in Atlanta or any of the surrounding cities in Atlanta, find Slutty Vegan in your city. One of the 13 locations that are opening or the other one that's already downtown established. Make your day. Oh, I want to go back right now for dinner. That's how serious it is. Can I go back for dinner? Oh my God. I'm sending back tomorrow. I'll work on it overnight. Anyways, so like, comment, subscribe, share. Follow us on all social media platforms. All of our YouTube And her YouTube. Well, I do have YouTube, but that's not my big thing. My big thing, follow me on IG, follow me on Facebook. And we'll see y'all around. Peace. Bye. Let's see if we're still recording. Mm. <clears throat> you should have did all that on the camera. Oh. Mm -hmm. I don't know.
Oh, that's good. I'm gonna get back in line. Mala? What, Mom? Dude, that's so good. Oh, well, that, that, that's what they say. I wanted again. Like, seriously, I wish you told me we could have gotten three apiece. I know it would have been. I heard. I heard the lady say. I ain't gonna lie. No, we don't have that in one day, and then not hair experience again. You okay? No, I need more. You just burp. I need more. Are you okay? No, I need more. I need more sluts. Three vegans in my life. I like sluts. Why am I Cause you're taller than me. Ain't no matter, dude. Down, Where you going me? with your bird with your mouth? I wanna go get my stuff. I knew he was gonna say that mess. When you realize how good it worked, I don't wanna hear your mouth. Anyway, y'all, we're dirty. supposed to be closing it. Baby, come on, close it out. I gave him all of our social medias. I hear you talking about me. I'm talking about you was the oats. Your mama. Okay. You ain't kidding. <laughs>